on the MLB pregame show. Matt Vaskersian getting you set for the finale of this three-game set. That'll come your way in mere moments, but first we'll take a look at the top's player spotlight. John Hulse will be in the glow as he comes into this game riding an impressive 20-game hitting streak. Steve, Eric, what have you seen from him lately that's been making him successful, and how long you think he can ride this? Well, it's really impossible to know how long he can keep this thing rolling. But I will say that he really looks like he's in a zone right now. I mean, when you think about it, even the balls that he doesn't hit particularly hard are still finding holes for him and doing some damage. Yeah, Steve, he does seem to have some good luck on his side, but I will say he looks awfully comfortable up there at the plate right now. John Pulse will stand in now as the National League's leading hitter entering play. Here's the first pitch. And here's a fastball that he takes the other way out to fairly deep right. And that ball gets down out near the wall and should be extra bases. Around second now, heading for third. Thrower won't get him. Well, this ball was hit pretty hard, and as you can see, probably not the best route to the ball out there in right field. And those extra few seconds are all he needed to decide to go for three, and he's in there with an easy triple. And he goes the other way with a fastball as this is hit well out toward deep left field. And now he has some trouble with it in left. And he will coast into second with a leadoff double. This is 
a hard hit ball back up the middle, and he's going to have his second hit tonight as it's into center field for a base hit. Swing and a ball hit in the air to right field, and deep back is the right fielder, but he will look up and watch this one sail out of here. It's a three-run shot to straightaway right field. Sixth home run on the season for him. And the Diamondbacks have stretched their lead now to 4 nothing. Well, he was close to getting out of this with just that one run scoring, but winds up making one more mistake here in the inning, and it's going to cost him three more runs. The two and two home. And this ball is popped up, drifting back behind the mound. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. Well, there have been some hard hit balls in the inning already, but this isn't exactly one of them, but it's going to work out well for him just the same. And this is lined into left field for their first hit of the ball game. fastball there. This is hit high and deep out to straightaway center field. And the fourth inning has begun with a home run. So it's a solo shot to dead center. His second of the game. And the Diamondbacks have come back to tie this one at two. seems to me like we've seen this before his second home run of the ball game and it would seem to me that he hit that one harder than he did the last one so he's definitely locked in it's no sure thing that a ground ball means a double play swing and a lighter back through the box and oh dear that caught him full bore on the mound as it ricochets back toward the plate and he is in there at third is the possible go-ahead score and this one will go down as an infield single and a pretty painful one at that what the doctor ordered out of the bullpen. Yeah, they needed him to come in and give him a strong hit. And this is going to get down for what should be extra bases. And there's your potential go-ahead run. And he'll pull into second with his fourth hit of the ball game. Well, you'll see how late he is on this fastball. I mean, he nearly takes this out of the catcher's glove, but somehow he's able to steer it fair down the line and he cruises in with a double. <laughs> 